What is going on, gamers? It's Dom here back once again. We're showing you guys the second year anniversary of the improved melee system. It's crazy to think it's been two years with Arma now getting uh, a full on mod for melee, not just the poke that we had previously, but a full on melee system where you can, you know, dodge, you can do animations like stealth kills and what's really cool that he added this time around is if i hit shift g now look at that the knife just rotated so that is like a cool little feature here with these knives in particular but we have a ton of stuff to go through and check out for this mod i definitely highly recommend if you guys are new to web knight's melee system uh, go check out any add-on options for the client settings and server settings. Definitely recommend that there. So tweak it to your likings, but not only that, go through in your controls. And this one's a little bit different in configure add-ons. It's listed as Web Knights Melee. Here you can mess around with the gesture menu, uh, your different key binds. Uh, I, for instance, love using shift mouse button 4 on my little gamer mouse. So it's uh, much easier to use the stealth kills there. I actually unbind my dodge. I never use it. I'd rather set that for space bar. Um, but it's all up to you guys on how you want to play the game. Uh, some different other modes for like fist fighting and the shift G is the weapon ability. So I'm kind of curious to see what other weapon abilities are out there. But I want to play this more actually in first person because if you guys remember the mod originally in first person, like it kind of worked. But it was more like it, it worked for a third person. Like it felt more smoother. And now we're at a point, honestly, with the mod where I feel like it's so damn smooth. It's so nice that it's like night and day difference when the mod itself already is a night and day difference here. You know, just seeing these animations in Arma. You know, like look at this, dude. You would never expect to see anything like that. And by the just kind and grace uh, ability of Web Knight, he's given the code out to people to make their own stuff. And within like an hour of this latest update, someone's already gone through for the Flood mod and added like the Halo weapons for the Flood, which is insane just that quick. So let's go check out some other weapons here. I'm trying to see what's new. Actually, let's check out these brass knuckles. I've been wanting to try them out for a while. And of course, you know, I'm not putting down anything to beat them up with yet. But let's actually do that. Let's go uh, poorly murder some civilians here. Uh, so I'm going to put you down there. And I'm going to try out, actually. Um, oh, got him. I want to try out some uh, stealth kills here. So I haven't really tweaked around any of the, the settings. So now the game's probably going to yell at me. Uh, like how it knocked that guy out there. But let's go here and let's go with the, uh, the UNSC knife. So I believe this is actually a, a Halo knife uh, that's in the main... Look at that. In the main mod here. So I highly recommend checking out the Grab Hammer. It's called Halo. Uh, IMS Halo. It adds the Grab Hammer, which... I just fling people around, but I'm mostly just checking out the main mod here. I should have done that actually in first person, but I guess we did one in first, one in third person. So let's go show off some other cool little things here. Um, I'm kind of curious. This Heinz Mace, I don't remember if that was there before. Let's put that down. Let's drop a civvy and let's go beat the crap out of them. Uh, and maybe I'll even try putting down some guys to see how they beat me up. I haven't done the uh, gesture menu yet. Let's see. So we have gesture one. Uh, okay. So it's just the gestures. What's uh F five? Oh, I can. Oh, I can walk around like I'm a Billy badass. Look at that. Got my white. Am I uh my weapon right here? Just chilling. I'm gonna wipe this guy out. Let's see, like the gesture menu. I hit it. Is it gonna remove it? Yeah. And then it goes back to, to idling. So that's cool. The animation changes after a while. And we go to uh, weapon inspection here. And I can even do that. Well, there's a little freaking uh, little HUD there on the bottom that tells you information about it. Stealth execution, yes. Move set, mace type. 
That's really dope. Okay, so you're dead. Snap your dang, snap his neck with the mace? My gosh. Let's see. I like how the brass knuckles, they just went and just freaking MJF'd him. And if you get that reference, shout out to all the wrestling buddies out there. Uh you know, let's yeah, let's use a good old bat. Can we get a... Uh, like Negan. We need a Negan style bat one night. Get us uh the barbed wire bat that he runs around with. So I don't know if there actually is one in any of the mods. There might be, maybe in aftermath. Check it out. Snapped your neck with the uh a baseball bat. Wait a minute. Whoa, what's going on there? I have it by my side. It's <laughs> that looks a little wonky. Maybe it's actually just one of the mods I have that's kinda conflicting with it there. Is it still gonna pop up on my side? Maybe. All right, let's go put down some guys. Let's go beat them up. I don't want to use the baseball bat. Let's go here. Let's check out what else is nice. I kind of really want to check out these knives. These knives are so cool. A uh, little spiked club. Who's gonna come beat me up? Honestly, I really just fallen in love with the Russian cavalry, uh, Shashka. Is that how you say it? Probably butchered it. Actually, crowbar. Crowbar for the win. Put down some melee AI. And uh, let's put down the guys with the fist who are going to beat me up first. So, Whoa, that sound. Yeah, I must have something because of the crowbar. Maybe, maybe I did butch it out, but who knows. Dude, come on. Come on. Square out. Square out. Huh? Yep. Yeah. Oh, wait. Come on. You would think I'd be better at the melee by now, honestly. Come on, dude. Oh, shoot, shoot. I don't know why I was going for, like, an air attack. So I was seeing if I could, like, jump and him in the air. Oh, ooh. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, come on, come on, come on. Right, he's probably only taking a bunch of hits, actually, because I haven't tweaked with the settings. Like I said, you want to go around and uh, tweak them a bit before you do anything. And I'm not playing with Ace here, by the way. I'm playing with a little custom mod set I just threw together. So, but more or less wanted to show off the uh, the weapons here. So let's see what else we got. What's another fun one to play around with? The katana. Got the katana. Oh, that is so smooth right there. Like, oh my gosh, these animations are amazing. And if I do gesture four, you know, point at him, say he's dead. Five. Oh man, that's dude, really badass over here. Let's go back here. Let's do uh, F6. Inspect the katana. Did he add custom inspections for all the stuff? That is insane. Let me return back to editor real quick. Then we'll go here, play as the character again. That is awesome. It's going to give me all my fun little config errors there. But let's go here and Hilda, F6, look at our knife. Yeah, look at that. It's got its own little inspection. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it must have been something. Maybe when I did the uh, stealth execution, it just popped up on the side again with the... Um, the weapon because it doesn't show up here when it went to first person it might just be a small little bug to work out so let's go and uh dude yeah okay we'll put down put down a dude over here to kill so come on bozo shoot all right let, give me a second let me go fix up these uh these settings for us here before we start stabbing some more guys all right, everybody. So what I did was I actually changed the melee damage multiplier here. Just like I said, another thing where you can tweak it and kind of get to your desire. You know, if you want them to instant kill, not them do any damage at all. Um, you can tweak that. I remember I tweaked that actually for a mission where I wanted them to be scared by the melee people, but not actually be killed by them. Um, so different like use cases there. What I'm going to do now is actually put down a couple bozos here. And we're just going to smash it up. Oh, that guy actually put the blunt hit there. So, it's 
seems like it's doing like a little area of effect actually with this uh this hammer here but uh, for our grand finale, I think I'm going to put down a whole bunch of guys, let them battle each other out, and you guys can see uh, what happens there. All right, everyone, we have a whole bunch of Caesar's Legions guys coming out here. We have a whole bunch of just super mutants running out here. I think I actually put them as, as Marcus, so there are a whole bunch of Marcuses running out here. But they're about to go and uh, tear each other up here in a second. I already see they're, they're staring off. So here they go. Who's gonna win? Who do you got your money on? Super Mutants or uh, Caesar's Legion? I think the coolest part is that it's not it's not breaking armor. It's not like there's a ton of guys on the ground, even for armor standards, especially with melee scripts and stuff going on there. It's pretty flawless, honestly. So. All right, well that's gonna do it here, and that's uh, that's a wrap. Looks like Caesar's Legion here is just com you know the complete winners, I think, and they're coming to kill me now. Actually, do I stand a chance? Probably not. Let's see. Come on, square up, square up, square up, bozo. Yeah, I'll break your stupid little shield. Oh my gosh, he got me by surprise. So. <laughs> That's going to do it here, everybody. You guys know what to do. If you made it to the end of the video, do all that good stuff. It helps the YouTube algorithm and the channel. Uh, with that, much appreciated. You guys have a great weekend. If you have any questions, leave them down below. And we'll see you all next time. Peace out.